What do you think of when you hear the word AI? Maybe you think of robots and self-driving cars, or maybe you think about chatbots and digital assistants. AI stands for artificial intelligence. Artificial intelligence refers to computer systems that can perform complex tasks normally done by humans, such as reasoning, decision-making, creating, designing, or coding. The concept of AI may seem new or almost futuristic in a sense. However, the history of AI goes much further back than you might think. The first ideas of neural networks, which ChatGPT and many other advanced chatbots use, were first proposed in 1944 by Warren McCullough and Walter Pitts. Neural networks are modeled loosely on the human brain. They consist of thousands or even millions of simple processing nodes that are densely interconnected. As of today, most neural networks are feed-forward, meaning that the data traverses through the nodes in one direction. The first trainable neural network only had one input layer, one layer with adjustable weights and thresholds, and one output layer. The chatbots we have today can have up to hundreds or even thousands of layers. This increase was possible thanks to the development of the Graphics Processing Unit, or GPU, in 1999. GPUs pack thousands of processing cores on a single chip, and their architecture is surprisingly similar to that of a neural network. Today, neural networks are used for many different tasks, such as facial recognition, self-driving cars, image analysis, medical diagnoses, fraud detection, data analysis, and more. Do you remember when ChatGPT first came out? For many of us, this may have been the first time we actually realized we were interacting with AI. If AI continues to develop at the rapid pace it is growing at now, it will continue to find new ways to shape our lives and the future ahead. While AI has begun to automate many existing roles, humans will continue to have a major part in maintaining AI tools and in helping our society to further grow and develop. Humans, unlike AI, are able to be innovative and come up with new solutions to problems. AI cannot produce new knowledge because it pulls its responses from the data that it's been trained on, which includes all the information that humans have already established. Still, AI will be used as a tool to better help diagnose diseases and personalize treatment plans in healthcare, enable personalized learning experiences for students in education, strengthen cybersecurity through technologies like predictive threat analysis and prevention systems, become personal assistants for people with disabilities, and more. Today, AI tools are capable of tasks that seemed nearly impossible for a computer to do only 50 years ago. What are some of the AI technologies that you currently engage with? ChatGBT or Gemini? Health tracking apps? What about Google Translate? All of these tools incorporate AI. How heavily do you interact with AI? And how do you want this to change or stay the same in the future? With the advent of new technologies, AI developments are occurring at a faster rate than ever before. Because we want to ensure that these AI tools successfully reflect human values, we must continue to work on improving AI's precision and accuracy. These fast-paced developments will eventually lead to new AI tools that will shape the future of our society. In what new ways do you think AI will affect you?